So it's our first interaction. Can you please introduce yourself? Sure, sure. My name is Indrajit Indrajit Bishwas. Mm -hmm. Currently, I am preparing for exams, government exams, and also I have a channel. Mm -hmm. I run my channel, and I have been uploading videos since 2020. 2020. Okay, three so, years. Yeah, it's okay. been three years. Okay. Uh, so my name is Shanta. <clears throat> By qualification, I am an engineer. Uh, I worked in the IT sector for a few years. So uh, currently, I'm a, a homemaker and uh, working uh, part time on this platform. Okay, great, okay, great. Okay. And I'm from Kolkata, ma'am. Where are you from? Uh, I stay in Karnataka, South India. Okay. Nice, nice. Yeah. So, uh, Indrajit, do you want me to correct you? As in, how we go? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I want feedback, and also whenever you feel to correct me, then you can correct. Okay, that's nice. Um, we have a topic for discussion today. It's called shopping. Would you want to go ahead with the topic, or have a general conversation? Yeah, we can go ahead with the topic. Okay. So I'll just ask you a few general questions. You can tell me your opinion about it. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Okay. So, do you enjoy shopping? Uh. Yes, I like shopping, uh, mm -hmm. especially uh, on occasion purpose. I like to shop. Okay, you, you also, like to yeah, shop for occasions. Yeah, on occasion. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. And as the Durga Puja is coming soon, this mm -hmm. is the biggest festival of Bengal. So I would like to shop right now. I mean, yeah, I think I am planning to shop. Okay, when is the Durga Puja? It comes in the month of October, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you started preparation already. <laughs> exactly, because oh. uh, Durga Puja is the biggest festival of Bengal, and this is all emotions are attached to this Puja. So that's why we are very, uh, like you can say that we are very, we are waiting in a great way, or after a long. One year, we have been waiting for this, so we are all prepared, all set to go. So and also, you look forward to this. Yeah, and also pandas are right now are being structured or constructed. Mm -hmm. So, what about general shopping? Other than for the occasion, what about general shopping? Uh, I like to shop um, electronic gadgets. Especially uh, mm -hmm. competitively clothes. Mm -hmm. So when I want to, or when it is needed to, for example, earphone or smartphone, then I would like mm -hmm. to buy. Mm -hmm. Which one do you do most? Like you know, you go go outside and shop, or you do online shopping? Uh, preferably, I would like to shop offline, but sometimes. Mm -hmm. Uh, something is not available offline also, so mm -hmm. we prefer sometimes we prefer to buy online, online product. But I love uh, offline shopping. Okay, you prefer online uh, uh, offline shopping. Offline, yes. Okay. Um, where do you usually shop? At your place, Kolkata? Uh, yeah, Kolkata is a very hot, and also there are a lot of varieties in Kolkata. So I mm -hmm. would like to shop. From okay, do you go to the malls or uh, street shopping or where uh, exactly? Sometimes I like to go to the malls because there are a lot of varieties. Otherwise, sometimes I try to help the uh, some uh, like I can say some shop which are like street shop so that it will be mutual and also it will be beneficial for them also. So that's why. I, Sometimes I go to the I go to shop for my clothes. Generally, or uh, normally, what I use, mm -hmm. I buy from kids shop. Okay, okay, okay. Just to help them, you know, contributing in the business. Absolutely, absolutely. Okay, that's nice. Okay, who do you take with you when you go shopping? Uh, uh, it's uh, actually I would like to go with my own. Or sometimes uh, go maybe, on your own. Yeah, on my own. 
and sometimes with my friends but uh, most of the time i would like to go to the uh, go for shopping on my own okay so like uh, you don't go with a family uh is a rare case actually they sometimes they surprise me to give some clothes so mm. i am i actually i usually surprise that's how they uh, buy clothes for me otherwise when i require or when something is needed then i just uh, tell them to buy it for me then they do they buy for you yeah so what do you do in the jeep uh, actually i am preparing for government exam and yeah, also yeah. i i was working in an ngo in the north portion of the state west bengal but uh, i would like to do government job for better stability so that's why i left the job and mm-hmm. i am as i am preparing right now i we start preparing for government exam okay. or other exam and mm-hmm. also and you can say like it is my passion so i would like to upload videos on my youtube channel iconic singer and going well i am really happy for that so how big is your youtube family how big we yeah. are <laughs> actually uh, i have 84000 subscribers but okay. some right now it is uh, like 2000 or 3000 are active watch active watch are actually so okay. i am happy well but actually it happened in the, during the lockdown it went mm-hmm. some video went viral during mm-hmm. lockdown that's why i have generated that subscriber otherwise mm-hmm. i have 2000 to 5000 active subscribers okay so what motivated you to open a youtube channel to start a youtube channel mm-hmm. actually i was so introvert to talk with my mm-hmm. family members and also with my friends in english okay actually i am introvert actually mm-hmm. so my family member used to say that you have to talk to in english or you have to talk to your friends in english so that it can help you in future mm-hmm. that interviews and all so that's why i started uh, my english speaking journey but i love learning english since my childhood uh, this language is really fascinating to me mm-hmm. i love learning english. i love learning new vocab new phrases new idioms and also i love to implement those kind of new words in daily life but for to improve my speaking skill to uh, sharpen my speaking skill i joined in tokyo and also i joined a lot of english speaking platform okay. so that to boost myself to boost myself to uh, face the people to interact with the new people with the native people from different countries and from different states okay yeah that's good but what about your hobbies what do you do during your free time in my free time i like to talk to myself in english or sometimes i like to watch some english movies or web series mm-hmm. and i used to like painting but uh, nowadays due to hectic schedule i don't have any time actually free time to paint for mm-hmm. but i used to like painting and also it is my passion i like to speak something i like to think something on which topic i would like to make a video so mm-hmm. it takes a lot of time and also editing plays mm-hmm. a great role for the yes, uh, it takes a lot of time, time. to edit a video yeah. so how how satisfied are you with your spoken english like from the beginning if you look back so how far have you come yeah this is a great question uh, i yeah the journey is quite well and also i have learned a lot of things and still are because it's a language so it's very hard so mm-hmm. i'm in a learning process but yeah i can say that i'm confident to speak with the strangers to speak with the native speakers and also to speak with the different tutors from different states different countries and i love interacting with new people 
and also to know the culture there and what they do actually mm-hmm. in their country and state so it's a really interesting journey i can say so how has your uh, personality changed so is there a difference you find you were an introvert so do you find any changes in your personality now are you open to talk to people yeah, now yeah it it boosted my confidence mm. and it to think in a different way something and also it really uh, feel it is relaxing and i am really enjoying this journey so that, that's why i really want to continue my speaking okay yeah, that's good right right practice can make you perfect right yeah. so we come to the end of the session is there something you want to ask me so oh, no it's okay and i think that it's a past session with you and it was a lovely session with you and Thank also you so i have interacted with you with different topics so it feels great yeah same here and uh, coming to your feedback just uh, you need a little bit of you know uh, correction in your pronunciation and the sentence flow yeah okay. that's the only flaws i found but you are a very confident speaker you know you i think you have a experience of interacting with many people yeah man that's why you, you come so out as a confident great feedback and also hope to see you soon yeah hope to see you soon okay enjoy the rest of your day yeah take care of yourself you too thank you bye